Tonight, 10 on your side digs deeper into why hundreds of SUV owners are discovering a problem with their vehicle's lift gate. Ford says the cracks are appearing in Fords, Lincoln, and Mercury's from the year 2002 to 2005. The vehicles are often out of warranty. Since there's no recall, drivers are having to dig into their pockets if they want the problem fixed. Since our first story aired last night at 6, dozens of you have reached out to 10 on your side with the same problem. Well, tonight our Melanie Woodrow reveals what could be causing this problem. Melanie. Alveda and Tom, these are both Wavy News 10 Ford Explorers. This one's a 2004, this one is a 2006. Ford added this additional lift gate design back in 2002, but went back to its original design in 2006 after those cracks started appearing. Ford is built for tough. That's, that's what they always said. And it doesn't look very tough to me. You know, it looks like I have a little girly truck. Matt Cobb bought his 2002 Ford Explorer in 2006 with just 48,000 miles on it. Two years later... You hear it hit. A little metal hit. And it wouldn't close. And it wouldn't close. And it wouldn't close. And then... Cobb soon discovered Ford Motor Company recalled the hinges on his 2002 Ford in 2004. By the time he realized he needed to have his hinges replaced, he discovered another problem. I started right here, with like a little pencil line. The crack expanded in length. And now, the extra set of cracks has come out. We can't determine if Cobb's theory on the defective hinges would eventually lead to cracks. We see easily one a month. Dale Blankenship owns the Mako on Pembroke Avenue in Hampton. He has more than 30 years experience. Um, you can push on these all day long and they're solid. They don't really move a whole lot. So it's, it's nothing that a customer could do to make this happen. It may be from the, the temperature variances from hot and cold. We can't confirm Blankenship's theory either. Whatever is causing the problem, Blankenship believes Ford should cover the cost of fixing it. And if you just open and close in a tailgate, it shouldn't break by itself. As for the design change Ford made in 2006. It very well could be that they knew they had a problem with this. They had a design change to it and to eliminate that product. One of Blankenship's customers lucked out today. Insurance covered a new lift gate because of an accident. The old one was cracked. Could happen again. Absolutely. Absolutely. And just because there's nothing wrong with this one doesn't mean it's going to stay like that for the rest of the time. Only time will tell. Only time will tell. We reached out to Ford Motor Company early this morning to see whether or not the hinge recall was at all related to the potential cracks that were developing in the lift gates. We have not heard back from Ford as of yet. Keep sending your stories in. We'll continue to investigate and let you know what we find out. Alvita? All right. We appreciate it. Thanks a lot, Melanie.